Afghanistan's Taliban government will be meeting international envoys on Sunday in Qatar for talks touted by the United Nations as a key step in an engagement process. However, the Taliban's meeting with the United Nations officials has been criticized by the right groups for not including Afghan women. It will be the third such United Nations-led meeting in Doha, but the first actually attended by the Taliban since seizing power in August 2021, as U.S.-led forces withdrew after 20 years. The United Nations will discuss counter-narcotics and economic issues during the meeting in Doha on the 30th of June and the 1st of July. Nearly 25 envoys, including some from the U.S. and the Taliban, will be attending. Standing out is the fact that civil society organizations, including advocates for women's rights, have been left out. The United Nations has been trying to find a unified international approach on dealing with the Taliban, who have cracked down on women's rights since returning to power. A large section of girls and women have been denied admission to schools and universities since the Taliban's return. The Taliban has also restricted travel for women without a male guardian, closed beauty parlors, prohibited women from entering parks and prevented Afghan women from working for relief organizations. For all the latest news, download the Wion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.